Well, remember, uh, Martin Lawrence had a movie like that. But I love horseback riding. Yeah. So much. It's Jay. Hey Peaches! Welcome to Preview, where friends don't let friends watch trailers alone. I'm Adam. And I'm Jay. Today we're going to react, review, riff, and at the end we're going to rate the brand new trailer as of a couple of minutes ago, thank god we timed this correctly, for Antebellum. Uh, coming from the people who made Us and Get Out, Okay. although Jordan Peele is not, did not direct this, this was some of the other guys that were part of the okay. other productions. The creative team? Yes. Uh, so this is a this is a movie. This is so scary. It's probably gonna be very. It's gonna it's gonna be scary, but also gonna be like very suspenseful. Suspenseful and like make you think and make you feel bad about. Yourself. I don't like to think. I know. No. You just like to react. That's, yeah. that's why we're that's why we're here. But it's about an author who's very successful. Ha! Ah! And then she that. wakes up on a plantation, I believe. She's got to figure out what the heck's going on. Get the heck out of Dodge. Oh boy. Yeah. So it's. We're gonna deal with some issues. Oh no. Hope you guys are ready for that. But before we get there, Jay, how are we gonna chalk them numbers? Well, since this is a horror flick, mm -hmm. uh, you are gonna go down into the cabin in the woods basement. Oh, uh, again? And pick something out, and I'm gonna tell you how you get murdered. Okay. Yay! Everyone's favorite <laughs> game! Okay, here we go. The trailer for Antebellum. We're expected to be seen, not heard, but we are the future. That was a short and a very effective trailer. Yeah, I gotta give him credit. That was what, 30 seconds? Yeah. If that? About 40, yeah, about 40 seconds. That's, man, that's very evocative. It gives you just enough. Holy crap. Holy, cr holy crap. It's like, it's a very huge response to like the three minute trailers we've been getting for other things. I appreciate the level of confusion that that's existing in. That it's just like, it's not, they're not telling us how any of this makes any sense or mm -hmm. happens. It's just like, this is what it is. Ooh. You know what this is? What is this? This is, like a, this is like the scary horror version of like a kid in King Arthur's court. He's like, ah, he travels back in time, but he goes like, he becomes a knight and yeah. saves the day. Yeah. And it's, I can't remember which comedian has a bit like that. It's like, we just can't, like, black people can't tr time travel. Because it's like, we just go back and it's like, well, we're slightly, like, that, this is like the whole, like, that's a off, horrible, horrible example of that. Where it's just like, ah, no, no. Well, remember, uh, Martin Lawrence had a movie like that called The Black Knight. Okay. Remember? So it can go good. Yeah, it was, yeah, it was, it was it can a go cheap, good. fun movie. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. This, looks, this looks awesome. Yeah. All right, Jay. Uh, I looks like that, We're going to chalk the numbers. Chalk that numbers. 2020, sloppy dab, okay, sloppy, sloppy dab. dab. That base, there's all my, so much stuff down this basement. Yeah, we're gonna go down. What are you gonna get out of the cabin in the woods basement? Oh. Yeah. Well, because of what we just saw, okay, and in the time period in which it was set, yes. And you know how much I love swords. This old, this old uh, cavalry saber looks awfully shiny. And oh, you're cool. gonna get like an old cavalry saber. Yeah, that's a pretty neat. Ooh, it's oh. so shiny. Neat. Ooh, it kind of slides out of the. Ooh, it's so neat and sharp. Oh. It's still pretty sharp. Oh no, I'm gonna put that away. Oh no. So you're gonna bring the cavalry blade up and like, then there's gonna be some like teenage hijinks, you know, like drinking out of a keg and like oh, okay. being buddies and like having fun. So you 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 guys uh, all uh, go to sleep and the girls are like, cool. I think I saw I think I saw like a a, a barn out out, out back. Uh, maybe we can uh, see if we can ride some horses tomorrow. I was like, great idea, great idea. You wake up in the middle of the night mm -hmm. and then you hear your horses like stomping around outside. Uh oh, and okay. you're like. Man, did Taylor, Taylor, and John and Bianca go out and ride horses without me? Cause that wouldn't be cool. Like, no. why would they leave me? Why wouldn't they be a part of it? I love horseback riding. Yeah, so much. And you don't hear anyone in the house, so you go out the front door and you're like, Taylor, John, Bianca, and then at the top of the hill, you just see the silhouette of a horse. Mm-hmm. 
uh, and, a, and a rider on top. Oh, okay. And, you're, and then you're like, guys. And then uh, the, the shadow starts moving. He's like, oh, I want to ride a horse. This will be fun. This will be fun. The shadow gets closer and it comes into the light. You see that it's uh, General Custer. General Custer? Yeah, oh, Custer. No. It's, it's from Custer's last stand. Yeah. But he's no. not on a horse. He is the horse. It's General, it's General Custer, but he is an evil centaur. And he has, uh, on, on the tip of his spear, Taylor and Bianca's head. Oh, and no! And he's dragging John behind him. Oh. Uh, and he's like, if you want to save your one friend that I haven't killed yet, you'll have, to, you'll have to race me to the edge of the world! You start running after him, and he gallops off. Uh, it's a foot race? Yeah, it's a foot race. Oh, you, got, you do a foot race against General Custer Centaur for your friend John's life. But Uh-oh. then at the last leg of, of the foot race uh-huh. against the Centaur, which you weirdly have gotten in the lead through tricks, ah, tricks and so smart, know-how. Smart. Uh, your your foot gets caught in a bear trap. Oh my god! Yeah, the centaur didn't see that happen, and it was kind of like off the, the beaten path a little bit. Sure, yeah. And nobody finds you, and then you just have your foot caught in a bear trap, and you can't get out, mm-hmm. and, and you starve to death. Oh, that was anticlimactic. Yeah, like the centaur's like. Uh, I guess I won, I guess. I, I guess I won. Yeah, oh, well. You, you starved to death. What happens to Jonathan? I'm sure he got centaur killed. Yeah, that, was, that got weird. That got super weird. Uh-huh. How would you rate this mini trailer for Antebellum? Man, this one's getting six out of six badass torch poses. What a good shot. I don't know what she was burning, but I was like, get it, girl. Yeah, burn, get burn it. it and burn everything else. Mm. Mm-hmm. Oh, how would you guys rate this trailer? Let us know in the comments below or hop on our Discord channel where lots of fun, cool people are talking about lots of fun, cool stuff. We'd love to have you join that conversation. The link is down below in our description box. And while you're down there, please like, subscribe. Hit that bell. Do that YouTube that you do so well. Guacamole is extra. You centaur fighting weirdos, you. And just like the movies, guys, the trailers never end. So click on the box showing up right now. Click that next video. We'll see you guys there. Bye. Bye.